Welcome to TechieV.com, your solution providers. This is Abhishek, and today we're going to be adding menu markers in videos in Premiere Elements. So, what these menu markers actually do is it creates these pinouts and pointouts in our video file, and we can use these particular menu markers in our video whenever we want, and that is simply going to give us points all across our video uh, which we can use in a menu marker to create a DVD or a professional video with, from where we can refer to another video or another point or portion of a video and the first two options to do this are either creating this markers button over here and click on, on menu markers and then click on set menu markers or we can simply go to our timeline to a particular portion right click on the blue button over here and click on set menu marker now we can add this particular portion any name that we want and name it to anything and click on marker type to be scene marker and click on the motion menu button over here and then simply click on ok and as you can see that gives us a green dot over here which indicates that we have created a menu mark now we can simply move across our video and to another portion and set menu marker again name it and simply with the same settings click with marker type to be scene marker and clicking the motion menu button we can click ok again and that gives us our second menu marker and in this way we can create multiple menu markers in our video and simply if we want and simply create other menu markers by the same technique by clicking on scene marker and clicking motion menu button and clicking on ok now actually what we have done till now is created three options over here and if we want we can create an ending point of this menu markers by right clicking and clicking by right clicking on this blue arrow and clicking on set menu marker and this is actually gonna be our last menu marker so we're not gonna name it and simply click and we're gonna create a menu marker a main menu marker over here and name it a collective title of to the video marker type is main menu marker and selecting the motion menu button we're going to simply click on ok and as you can see this blue button gives us our main menu marker so what we can do now here is take a point before the actual menu marker in order to make sure that we create an ending point after which only on selection a particular person can view the video so we're going to right click there and click on set menu marker and because we are ending our file strip and making a stop marker over here we're not going to name it and simply click on stop marker and click on ok and as you can see that gives us our red stop marker over there now to open up our menu markers we're gonna go to tools and go to movie menu over here and that gives us our various options and select this basic slideshow the first option and then we're gonna go to scene menu one and as you can see we can change these names if we want but first of all these are the movie menus that we created and and premier element simply gives us these particular pinpoints in our movie so that we can control so that we can simply skip over the content in a particular dvd or even a digital movie so what premier elements actually done actually did for us is actually it divided our video to this particular pinpoints that we wanted to use in order to divide our video into particular sets that we have created 
and so if we simply click on arcs of the sea it's gonna take us to those particular portions of the image and if we want we can simply skip or hide a particular portion of the video from the whole video and only make it accessible by clicking on particular spots like the spirit of god or the golden bridge or arcs in the sea so that was using movie markers in premiere elements thanks for watching please like and subscribe